a guide catheter is introduced into the femoral artery, navigating through the aorta and across the aortic arch, accessing the main coronary ostium. A flexible guide wire is introduced through the catheter into the artery and is advanced toward the distal end of the vessel. The ND infusion catheter is introduced over the guide wire and is positioned within the intended segment under fluoroscopy. The balloon accommodates a variety of vessel diameters through its ability to expand up to 4.5 millimeters, thus reducing the need for multiple catheters for different patients. The balloon controls blood flow, helping to localize stem cells into the targeted area during infusion. Stem cells are introduced into the catheter and move through the system towards the catheter tip. The expansion chamber regulates the flow velocity before the cells enter the multiple lumens. The stem cells are separated through multiple channels, reducing the likelihood of clumping, leading to embolization and heart attack. This dispersion leads to better mixing of stem cells with the blood and potentially better tissue distribution. In comparison to conventional balloon delivery systems, the ND catheter's multiple infusion lumens remain uncompressed during balloon inflation, thus protecting stem cells from shear stress and preserving cell viability. Additionally, the balloon's unique design reduces radial forces, potentially minimizing vascular trauma. The balloon is deflated, the catheter is retrieved, and the guide wire and guide catheter are withdrawn.